is going on with my hair? Good morning and welcome to today's vlog. I realised I totally forgot to introduce yesterday's vlog yesterday, so I thought I'd really quickly talk you through what I done yesterday. I had a fairly busy day, I am exhausted this morning. I started my day with a quick meeting at the Hoxton and I had some nice breakfast. I had a little salmon bagel, it was very nice. Before going on to the Moon Pig event, which was actually really cool as well. I didn't realise Moon Pig done more than cards. They had beautiful flowers. They had um, like everything, hampers, chocolates, cakes, cards. Just like loads and loads and loads of things for um, Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, Easter, and even like for babies when they're born and stuff and for mothers when they have their babies. Um, so that was quite fun. And then after that, I went to the deck which is on top of the National Gallery, and I went with Gillette. And of course, as soon as we get outside, it's going to start to rain. <laughs> Off to my next event in the rain. healthy but really tasty as well and it was pretty chilled and then had my first ever yoga lesson and I was pretty scared. I'm going to include some clips now. So I'm now about to start yoga and it's my first time I've ever done yoga and admittedly I'm pretty scared and I didn't really until I noticed that I was biting my nails um, so clearly I'm scared but it's a pretty incredible place to do my first ever yoga class. It's a shame it's a grey day but still. Got a little mat. I guess I'll report back post first ever yoga class. So we just finished yoga as I said and I got changed, I've done my makeup pretty much in the dark so I should probably check on it. I'm actually probably going to use my phone selfie camera to have a quick look. I think it's alright but it was literally in the dark. And we're now off the surf for dinner and I've never been there but it's supposed to be amazing so I'm really looking forward to it. And yeah I've just had a really really nice day, like I really can't complain, um, check out this view. I mean seriously what a nice place to do my first ever yoga session dinner at Circus. Circus is in Covent Garden and it's just a restaurant um, but they kind of do like little displays whilst you're eating as well. <laughs> So we just got to Circus and they're clearly not open yet. Um, they only open at 6 so we're just kind of hanging around because we're like 15 minutes early for them to like start I guess and for them to see us. way to Coworth Hotel and I got very excited so I'm going to include all the clips from then. I've probably got some cab ones as well. We just got to the hotel and obviously it's dark so I can't really show you very much but um, yeah, really 
really looking forward to it. Oh god, my voice gone funny. We just got an ad me up here, um, blaring some music on the way up. But um, I'm pretty tired now. I've had a little bit of alcohol too. And the temptation to just collapse on that um on the bed is real especially after a pretty beleaguered um cab ride over here but my hotel room is incredible so i thought i'd really really quickly show you around there is a four poster bed and i can honestly say i've never slept in a four poster bed so excited about that a pretty large wardrobe there's me oh yeah i'm wearing like these little leather trousers i forgot um, a desk, my clutter, um, a little sitting area, and then in here is the bathroom. And I was a bit disappointed that I only had a shower, but then I saw the bathtub. Whoa! And I'm definitely having a bath. I would like to be in bed in probably about half an hour, 45 minutes, but this bath is so beautiful, it would be rude not to run a bath. But now it's um, coming up to quarter past seven, which for me is pretty early. Eh, it's like ten past. I am about to check out my hotel. I had such a lovely stay. I am massively tired this morning though because. I didn't sleep enough. We were only at the hotel for 10 hours. Well, by the time I leave, I would have been here for 10 hours. I'm leaving at 8 o'clock. Um, and my neck, well, this muscle here is sore. Um, I don't think it's my neck muscle. I don't think I strained it. I think it's just from, um, like, the planks and stuff yesterday during yoga. Um, but to be fair, I think I would have been quite disappointed if I woke up. And I wasn't a little bit sore because I do feel like I, the yoga was a good workout. Um, but... I am running late, so I'm gonna run to breakfast. I'll show you that, and I'll show you the rest of my day. We're going to the Gillette R&D um, Center for a little bit of a nosy around. <laughs> quickly touch base. I think I am wearing the same jumper as I was in the first few clips of this video but it is a different day. Today is Thursday and I'm hopefully uploading this vlog as soon as I finish filming this thing but I didn't have an end clip for this video and the reason is because I said that I was going to take you to the R&D centre but I didn't because we weren't allowed to film in there sadly. It was surprisingly interesting though. We like learnt about how they develop razors years in advance, how the women's ones are actually probably sharper than the men's ones, and that they're designed for your body a bit better because the men shave quite a flat area, but obviously our legs and our thighs and our underarms aren't that flat compared to a face anyway. So they're designed a little bit differently, especially like your underarm where it kind of curves in. They're really designed to cater to a woman's needs. But um, other than that, it was really interesting. They watch people shave. I don't know if I just said that, but they have about 80 people come in to shave, which is crazy if you watch someone shave as well. Um, and yeah, it's just quite weird, but um, I guess it makes sense. Other than that, I wanted to mention that this isn't sponsored because last time I filmed my trip to Spain with a brand, with Santa Verde, everyone's like, oh, it's sponsored, it wasn't sponsored, neither's this, but I just felt like it was quite a fun day, so I would feature it, I didn't have to or anything like that, but I just thought I would. Also, this was quite a fancy day. Typically I vlog on days where I'm staying at hotels or I have something fun going on, just because I feel like it's funner for you guys, but I don't want you guys to think this is what my life is like. Obviously I do get some really beautiful and like fun and amazing experiences through blogging, but Generally, my life is spent at home in pyjamas, and trust me, that's nowhere near as glamorous or as beautiful as the hotel that I stayed at in this vlog. And on from that, I am actually staying at another fancy hotel today. This will be the last kind of nice hotel for a while, I promise. But if you want to follow my day along before I upload a vlog, so I will be vlogging today as well. My Snapchat is a little obsessed. If you add me today or tomorrow, you'll still get to see my Snapchats from today and tomorrow. 
and actually probably even if you add me on Saturday you'll still get to see tomorrow's snapchats um, but otherwise I still snapchat all the time so hopefully you'll enjoy that and I shall see you fingers crossed on Sunday bye